You have to try to come back with the Mexican word. Yeah. And I'm going to give you a clue about, his, about history. If okay. your knowledge about the history is good, you are going to, to find out. Okay. okay. The word, the Mexican word is clavado. 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 What does clavado mean? Okay. No, it means nailed. A, a clavo is a nail. Clavar yes. is to hammer a nail. Bien, sí. Or to nail. Exactamente. Clavar mm -hmm. algo. Clavar si algo. No, nosotros en español decimos, la has clavado cuando has acertado. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in English, too. Wow. in English too. You nailed it. You nailed it. If yeah. you are a gymnastic and you jump, puedes clavarlo <laughs> cuando caes al suelo y no mueves los pies. Ha hecho un clavado. Ah, okay. Yeah, like, to, plant, to plant yourself. Yeah. But in Mexico, when you're talking about football in Mexico, what does clamado mean? Okay. And no, I'm you... going to give you, I can give you the, the clue. It's very important, the clue. Okay. okay. Si sabes de historia, lo vas a acertar. Porque, dice el titular, periódico mexicano, el día que Robén, Robén, el jugador de, de holandés, Bayern Munich. eliminó a México del Mundial con un clavado. Con un clavado. Okay. Robén hizo algo en un mundial que eliminó a México con un clavado. Si recuerdas ese momento, you know the meaning of the word. Now, you, you said if you know your history, you meant football history. I was expecting you to ask me a question about uh, Zapata or something. You know, like Mexican history. <laughs> Zapatazo. Or what was his name? Uh, Diaz, ¿no? Por, uh, en, un, en, un, en, un Diaz, mun, en un mundial, uh -huh. Me eh, eh, Holanda elimina a México. Uh -huh. En ese mundial juega Robén, uh -huh. el jugador de Real Madrid, de, del, del Chelsea, Chelsea, Chelsea etc. Yeah. Muchos jugadores. Y eliminó a México del mundial con un clavado. Hizo algo que se llama clavado que eliminó al conjunto, a la selección mexicana. Entonces, Mexican National Side. ¿Qué es lo que hizo Ariel Robén? I can't remember. I can't remember oh what God. Robin did. No, was this the 2010 you, World you Cup? You saw that World Cup, obviously, obviously because he was he was playing Robin. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember Robin in 2010 and 20. I, I, am, go I am going to give you another clue. Okay. Ro Robin was playing the ball in the cl very close to the to the the byline. Okay. Uh, okay. Is it? Okay, I'm, I'm just going to go for a, a complete guess. If you're close to the byline, there's not much you can do to score from the byline that isn't, unless it's a chip. Is it a chip, Vaselina? Is chip. that your answer? Yeah, let's go for it. No! Ha clavado is a dive. Robin dive, the referee, ah. a whistle for a penalty, and yeah. Mexico was eliminated of that World Cup. Ah, so Mexico. Clavado es tirarse, es un piscinazo. Piscinazo, yeah, exactly, piscinazo. a dive. Ah, Remember okay. the word that Robin in the byline and something put the the the, the leg, but mm -hmm. Robin jump uh, and the the referee understood it was a penalty. Yep. And was a clavado, una se tiró, fue un piscinazo. Ah, okay. So Robin dived. We would say Robin dived, dived. against Mexico. Robin yeah. dived against Mexico. I can I honestly don't remember that at all. Um, what World Cup was it? 2010 or 2014? Uh, I don't remember right now, but uh, he was was it, was a World Cup that Robin played. So yeah, I think so he we, was in 06 as well. I think he we are going to share on social media. That's so it. Everybody yeah, can remember this moment. We need to find the video. Sorry for any Mexicans listening to be reminded of that painful, <laughs> painful experience. But yeah, God, um, clavado. I would have never got that. I would have never got that correctly. It sounds like you know because in football, if you nail it. You know, I would think that it was a shot or a goal or a, something like that. But no, absolutely not. Okay, well done. Un clavado, un pistinazo. 